Obviously with a boat like this it gives you a lot of options. You can uh, fish bottom bashing like we're doing today. You can do the marlin season uh, up around Cairns and uh, a few day trips uh, or overnight trips or even a couple of day trips uh, out uh, off off the Cape and uh, and out on the on the wider ground. So it's it's fairly versatile, isn't it? Yes, uh, boat's purposely built for marlin fishing. We spend three months of the year fishing out of Cairns and Cooktown for the big billies and the rest of the year we'll spend down working out of uh, Scarborough, Brisbane and mainly chasing uh, uh, blues in early, early, uh, early New Year uh, being uh, January, February, March and uh, after that season we chase uh, a little bit of bottom bashing for the boys which we mix it up with a bit of uh, game fishing in the morning chasing our pelagics and then moving on to bit of uh, bottom bashing on the afternoon or reef fishing. But and what about if somebody wanted to book the boat for uh, a couple of days, is, is that a possibility? Yes, uh, we have uh, clients who, who like to uh, spend a bit more time on our boat and a two day, three day tour is um, quite quite alright with us, uh, we quite enjoy that actually, uh, being at sea longer than uh, having to come back and forwards from shore. And, and covering the east coast is um, very enjoyable and there's a lot of nice boating areas to um, to see and, and, we'll, and our experienced skipper Shane Steer is very experienced at uh, giving our customers what they want. Caught on this, Dave. Caught, I think. <laughs> I just want to point out that the knot didn't break. It's halfway along the leader. It's frayed through. Took me into the reef. Oh, look. I think, I think conservatively estimating maybe two, 200 kilos, something like that. I'm pretty sure that was a snap too. Yeah, right. Yeah. Not bad. Oh, look at the colours of that, eh? Isn't that beautiful? Getting back in the water. Whee! Little Maori, probably too small. Must have turned the boat around. Don't think about that knot. <laughs> oh, you're kidding. Holy fuck, I'm alive!